We are often awestruck by the large salaries that actors receive for their roles, and for good reason. When we see actors like Scarlett Johansson and Robert Downey Jr. making $15 million for a single film, it's difficult not to be taken aback. Johnny Depp is in the same league of A-listers. However, he is a man of surprises. According to Sharon Stone, the actor once donated his entire earnings from a film to a co-star's daughter. So which film was it? Who is his co-star? Keep watching to find out. Depp appeared in the 2009 fantasy film The Imaginarium of Dr. Parnassus. Terry Gilliam wrote and directed the film, which starred Heath Ledger, Andrew Garfield, and Christopher Plummer. Unfortunately for the film crew, Heath Ledger, best known for his role as the Joker, passed away mid-production. Johnny and the other co-stars shocked the world by agreeing to contribute all of their earnings from the movie to Ledger's daughter, Matilda Ledger. Matilda was only four years old at the time, unable to understand what exactly was going on. The untimely and tragic death of Ledger threw Gilliam's project into disarray. Filming was not finished, and Gilliam had to figure out how to complete the film without one of his stars. Depp, Colin Farrell, and Jude Law stepped in to finish the film. That was notable enough, but the trio went above and beyond by deciding to donate their entire earnings from the film to Ledger's young daughter, Matilda. According to She Knows, the fact that Ledger's daughter will benefit from the salaries of stars like Depp, Law, and Farrell all of whom command a pretty penny, can only enhance the magical effort that was put together to finish this film amid shocking tragedy. The film received great reviews from the critics, who mainly commended Ledger's final performance. Many were also concerned for his daughter, but Depp's actions assured that she will be taken good care of. The amount that was donated by the three actors has not been disclosed. However, Matilda is now living a great life thanks to them. Matilda Ledger, who was born on October 25, 2005, is now 16 years old. Matilda has been living in New York with her mother and stepfather, Thomas Kale. According to sources, she also has a one-year-old brother or sister. Michelle has kept Matilda out of the spotlight since Heath's death. However, the paparazzi have managed to catch a glimpse of the two on occasion. According to reports, Matilda, who looks like her father, is looking forward to spending the summer in Perth, Australia, with her grandparents, Kim Ledger, and his ex-wife, Sally Bell, as well as spending time at Cottesloe Beach, which was Heath's favorite spot. Terry Gilliam, the director of the Imaginarium of Dr. Parnassus praised the actor's generosity by ensuring that they didn't take the money. It goes to Heath's daughter. Terry went on to say, that's extraordinary and fantastic. When you're part of it, you think, ah, maybe this is why I got into movies in the first place. I expected it to be full of wonderful people, and we have a film full of wonderful people who went above and beyond to help. The four actors were filming for the Imaginarium of Dr. Parnassus, but were unable to continue due to Heath's absence. It has not been revealed how much the actors paid her in total, but it was their entire salary. This was Ledger's final performance, as he was working on the film at the time of his death in 2008. Ledger died of an apparent accidental drug overdose at the age of 28. According to Cinema Blend, those who worked with him on Imaginarium reported erratic behavior. In fact, his co-stars were concerned after witnessing him take a cocktail of sleeping pills and other drugs in an attempt to sleep during a bout of troublesome insomnia. Since his time on The Dark Knight, where his dark and twisted portrayal of the Joker earned him critical acclaim despite personal challenges. Ledger's mental state had been portrayed as unstable. Heath Ledger's fame skyrocketed in 1997 with the hit film 10 Things I Hate About You, in which he co-starred with Julia Stiles. Since then, Ledger has received 58 nominations, including a BAFTA, a Golden Globe, and an Oscar for Best Supporting Actor for the 2008 film The Joker, The Dark Knight. According to history, Ledger died on January 22, 2008, at the age of 28. His death was caused by an unintentional abuse of prescription medications. According to reports, the actor was suffering from insomnia and was taking anti-anxiety medication. He died a month after breaking up with her then-girlfriend Michelle Williams, and he was halfway through filming his final film, Imaginarium of Dr. Parnassus. What do you think of Johnny's kind heart? Let us know in the comments down below. If you enjoy watching the video, make sure to like and subscribe to keep up with our latest uploads. See you in the next video.